Here's a pool and backyard update. We have the seed down and I just need it to rain today so I don't have to keep watering. Ha <laughs> ha. And the diving board was supposed to be installed, but apparently that that's not going to happen because the diving board apparently has three bolts instead of four. So now they have to get different equipment to saw cut the bolts off and redo it. So I have been working just um, at my desk all morning and I am now going to get my hair done. I'm kind of on a four week cycle with that. And um, then I have a meeting with a developer over at the Lake of Springs. So should be a great afternoon. I'll keep you posted. Here's my before picture. So I was just getting ready to walk out the door to go up to the Novelty Reno um, and the contractor said that we're not going to be working up there today. So change of plans for today. And then when you know it, the pool guys called and said, hey, are you going to be home today? We can come back and finish your diving board. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I am. I think my kids would be really happy to have that done. So now the only thing I have to figure out is how to get that first pumpkin spice latte that I was holding off on having coffee this morning so that I could have that on my way up to Cleveland. Um, if you're new here, <laughs> this is going to be a laundry room and we're making my daughter's bedroom a little smaller. I really thought that I was going to be able to reuse this wall that was already perfectly framed for the closet, but what I've learned so far is that everything is glued together. And after about 20 minutes of trying to nicely pry this um, away from the floor and the wall and the ceiling, I went to get this uh, scale saw. Got myself some new clear safety glasses. That's That was fun. Just found them randomly. Um, I'm hopefully about to get the last little section done now. Um, I feel like what I should be able to do is just pull this because I've cut it down there. You can see doo -doo -doo -doo, like right here. I cut it and I just can't get it. Uh, I'm wrapping up for the day. I did a little bit of cleanup after I finished removing um, these really, really well constructed walls for this closet. Um, I found a six inch diameter vent that's coming up from, I don't know, maybe my laundry room or just the basement, I guess. So 
I'm not actually showing the jog in the wall, but the jog in the wall occurs right here. So I was kind of thinking that I would bring this about right here. So the laundry room would almost end right there and then I would go into a closet, but I don't know. Abby really doesn't need that big of a room, so maybe I should stick to my original plan. I'm really going to want the counter space in the laundry room to fold laundry and keep baskets out for the kids. And so, anyway, it's a work in progress. And when I'm kind of controlling it myself, I can make these decisions along the way. So, that's it for now. Can you give us a few words, Abby? Yeah. Can you tell us what you think about it? <laughs> Obviously, you're enjoying it. I guess we're going to have to take that to the bank. <laughs> I think this is going to be my weekend.